Hey dads, are you looking for a good crafting kit for your kids to do while you're doing some time, something for yourself? Uh, I find that arts and crafts are a great way to get your kids to be like hands-on doing something and it still gives you some time to do other things. You don't have to like hover over them and help them or anything like that. So I want to talk about one today that my daughter uh, did that her grandmother got for her for Valentine's Day. I think it was Valentine's Day. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic reviews of the products that I like, use, and have. So if you're into that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. Also, that thumbs up button is very much appreciated if you guys could hit that. Also, if you do decide to subscribe, make sure to hit the bell. That way you actually get notified of our videos. So the product that I want to talk to you guys about today is this Melissa and Doug created by me. Uh, this is the Owl Bank one, and it's an art and craft kit uh, right here. Uh, my, I did a review of the one that my uh, mom gave to my son, which was uh, the painted dinosaur things. And I wanted to show you guys what she got for our daughter in case you have a daughter that you need want to get something uh, for them. So the way this works is you have this, uh, this came white. This was originally white and it is an owl and it comes with, come see, let's go get the paint. I got the paint, they, they haven't uh, <laughs> messed it up yet. <laughs> but it comes with these, uh, these little, little tiny tubs of paint. I don't know what they're called. Uh, these are the different colors you get, red, yellow, green, blue, white, and black. And then of course, you know, if they want to experiment, they can mix together their colors and learn a little bit about color mixing and all that type of stuff to create new colors. But uh, this is what my daughter created. Taking her time and really focusing on making each one of these a different color, I really like how she did that. I also like how she used all the different colors uh, throughout the owl and kind of gave it patterns and whatnot. That was really, uh, really cool to see. Now this particular craft kit is actually a bank. So there's a little slot up top here that she can put coins in or money in. And then on the bottom they have a little rubber uh, popper outer thing there that you can uh, so you can get the coins out. I haven't tested out any coins yet. I would assume that's at least the size of a half dollar to be able to get uh, in and out of there. Uh, I do notice that there is a little notch right here so that it's easy to get this uh, little rubber stop out at. We have some other piggy banks. I should actually do a review of those that uh, they don't have like a little notch right here to be able to get your finger in there and pull that out. So that's, I really like that on this, uh, this little bank here. This uh, also, not only does it come with this kind of paint, it also comes with a little uh, glitter pen, I guess, if you will, a little glitter glue, uh, glitter glue type of stuff. So if she wanted to add a little bit of extra sparkle to it, she could. It also comes with a paintbrush that goes right here. I don't know what happened to the paintbrush, but um, I'm sure it got used and abused. <laughs> but uh, this is just a fun, so one day, Whenever I was working in our food forest, I was trying to get a whole bunch of compost out of the truck. And uh, the kids, d uh, by themselves, got this art project out after my mom had given it to them. And they just started doing it all by themselves. I was so impressed that they uh, took the initiative uh, to get it all out by themselves. They even got all the paint out. They even got a little cup of water so they could clean off their brush. They were sharing all of the paints and the little glitter pen and everything. So um, I was very pleased to see them doing that, but it also let me know that this is a great tool to have like your, if you have more than one kid, they could bond together, sit down and paint together. They could work together. They can share together uh, and they can just kind of see what they're, uh, they're both creating together. So I really, really like that. Um, some different things that they mentioned on the box here that I wanted to point out is that they can uh, play with different colors, like putting a light coat of a certain color makes it, you know, like a light green, or if you put a whole bunch, it becomes a darker green. Um, and get a washed effects and you can mix up the colors to get different shades. They've talked about playing with details and adding designs to it like little leaves and flowers and little stars and whatnot. Um, doing outlines, they talk about outlining different things so you could teach your kids um, you know, how to take the black to make it pop a little bit more. And then playing with dots as well, just using dots as opposed to coloring in the whole thing. Uh, another thing they can learn about is patterns and like using spirals and stripes. Uh, on their designs here. So it's a great, uh, great tool so that they can learn a little bit more about art, about the different color combinations, about light colors and dark colors and all that type of stuff. Um, so I can highly recommend this. Like I said, I'll link it up down in the description below if you guys want to check it out. And I'll also link up some of the other ones. Like I said, my, my son got the dinosaur one. So if you guys have a son out there who likes dinosaurs, I'll see if they have any other ones down in the, uh, in the description below. I'll link them all up for you. I got to know from you guys, what's some of y'all's favorite crafts that you do with your kids? Um, 
I know a lot of times dads work a lot. They don't get a lot of time to spend, uh, you know, actually doing stuff with their kids. And I think crafts is a, a great way that you guys could could bond together. So uh, think about doing something like this because it's always fun to make a mess. I like making a mess and to get some paint out and put it all over the place. <laughs> so let me know some of y'all's favorite uh, crafts that you guys do with your kids. Uh, if you guys want more uh, videos from us, I'm going to put some more right there on the screen. I'd love it if you guys watched more of our videos. Also, make sure to click that subscribe button if you're liking what we're doing here on Dad Reviews. I uh, definitely appreciate it when you do that. And if you do decide to subscribe, hit the bell icon. That way you get notified of our videos too. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If there's something that you want us to review here on Dad Reviews, let me know what it is down in the comments below and I'll see if I can get it for you. Thank you all for watching. Dad out.